I am showing you some things I got to see at a pretty nice Goodwill. And then I have a little haul at the end to share some of the treasures that I picked up. There were so many things I would have loved to pick up, but I just couldn't do it. So I'm thinking I might start an eBay store or a Facebook Marketplace store to sell some of these fun things I find. But anyways, um, come along and see what I get to see at Goodwill. So these Keds were in decent condition and considered buying them to resell. They were just a little bit too worn. And then I'm always in a mindset of looking for vintage pictures. So anything white that looks kind of like a picture, I will have to pick up and look at. I want to say this sled was $4. I know it didn't show well in the video here. And then the rolling pin, I think, was 3 And I think this basket, picnic basket, was also $4. It did not show again. And this Made in Spain adorable glass container was such a debatable piece. Um, I loved that color. And I think it was one seventy five. Flip top glass containers in canisters are always a thing I pick up and look at as they are so convenient for storage and really cute as well. Baskets are another thing I always have to pick up and look at, but in Goodwill you can have a hit or miss on whether the baskets are a good price or not. All right, so I'm gonna quickly show you what I got. There were so many cute things, like I said, but I did get this picture. It doesn't say where it's made, so maybe some of you know what it is, where it's from, but it was $2.75, so cute. And we live in a Danish community, so that kind of just reminded me of like a Danish or a Dutch scene. Um, and then of course, I did get one flip top canister, and it's a Fida or Fido. So even if I made like homemade jelly or something, I don't know, put some homemade pickles in there just to put in the refrigerator. And then I'm gonna show you one more thing I actually found at a garage sale that you guys are going to absolutely love. So yes, you are seeing that right. $4 for the whole box of these beautiful plates. There is just one mug is all, but I'm pretty sure these are worth some money and they'd be so cute to decorate with during the fall and winter months. The scenery on them, oh, they're just so beautiful. There's no markings on the back, so I don't, again, know what kind of, oh, here we go. They were made in 1965 in Ohio. They are ironstone, that's what I thought. So, beautiful plates for $4, there's some crack but I just could not pass that up and I knew you guys would enjoy seeing that. Mm -hmm. 